Prince Harry could deeply regret a decision that he once made, as it never occurred to him it might end up threatening his whole life plan, a royal expert has claimed. The claims come after the Duke of Sussex wrote about his past encounters with drugs in his memoir Spare, which was released in January last year. In the 2023 publication, Harry recalled an experience with magic mushrooms and wrote, I stared at the bin. It stared back. What staring? Then it became a head. I stepped on the pedal and the head opened its mouth. A huge open grin. However, following the book's candid confessions, questions were asked about whether he disclosed this information on his US visa application when he moved stateside. Royal author Tom Quinn claims that the Duke and Duchess of Sussex have since taken legal advice over worries that, if Donald Trump were to win the US presidential election later this year, Prince Harry's residency status could be put in jeopardy. The couple have taken legal advice because they're seriously worried that if Donald Trump wins the next election Harry's visa may be revoked. Trump has insisted that if Harry is found to have lied on his visa application about his admitted drug taking, he could be asked to leave the country, he said. The royal expert added, Harry initially thought this couldn't possibly happen to him as the normal rules don't apply to a royal prince, but he is increasingly realizing that in the United States being a prince doesn't actually count for very much. But one thing is for sure Harry deeply regrets ever making his drug taking public. It never occurred to him that this might end up threatening his whole life plan. Last month, Royal reporter Jenny Bond claimed that the situation could spell fresh concerns for the Duke of Sussex, and that he must regret being so open in his memoir. Harry must regret having been so frank about drugs in his book. It really wasn't a necessary part of the narrative although I understand that he was trying to explain his mental health issues, she said. But admissions like that can have consequences and, right now, he must be feeling the heat. I think he's fine as long as the Biden administration continues to back him. But things could be very different if Trump became president again.